over the years, scientists have made some pretty wild discoveries. From it, we got amazing things like electricity, medicine, vaccines, you name it. But over the years, they also have come across a number of disturbing discoveries. From the possibility of a head transplant to parasites that can live under your skin. Let's talk about these and more only in today's video. Top 10 disturbing scientific discoveries of all time. Starting off this countdown, we have the head transplant. So scientists have discovered a way to transfer a head from one body to another. I know, I know, it's crazy, let me explain. So Italian surgeon Sergio Canavero managed to attach a smaller rat to a larger rat and still kept the rat alive. The rat was still fully functioning. He also claimed to have successfully done this with dogs. And in 2016, he did this on a monkey. Apparently, he does this by attaching the spinal cords together. And now he's looking for real life people to be a part of his experiment. He wants to be able to do this on humans. Maybe that's why Walt Disney had his head frozen for so many years. He's waiting to be attached to another, younger body. Just kidding. But seriously, this is terrifying. In our ninth spot, we have the alien DNA. And if you guys are liking this video so far, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and make sure you stick around right to the end of the video because I am shouting out your weird comments. <laughs> In 2014, it was discovered that DNA can survive re-entry from space. Basically, Swiss and German scientists put DNA on the exterior of a rocket. The rocket then did a trip around space and back to Earth. And they found that the DNA on the rocket survived. Meaning, if there is life out there and they sent a message to Earth, their alien DNA would successfully survive on Earth. This has scared a lot of people because they think an alien invasion is now possible which is pretty creepy, not gonna lie. Also, that means intergalactic bacteria and disease can also survive its trip to Earth, which can threaten humanity. Isn't that great? Moving on to number eight, we have the deadly snails. So snails are slow, tiny creatures that no one really fears, but maybe we should. Apparently snails are one of the most deadly animals in the world, why? Well, freshwater snails kill up to 20,000 people a year. People die after drinking water contaminated with snail eggs. If you do this, then you develop a condition called schistosomiasis. Guess what? These snails can live three to 10 years in a host's body. In some cases, they have lived 40 years inside of a person, which is disgusting. And I never want to swim in a lake ever again. Just kidding, but seriously, add snails to the list of things that I'm afraid of. In our seventh spot, we have the viruses. The advancements we have made in medicine is quite fascinating. Over the years, millions of lives have been saved as a result. But I got some bad news. Some microbes are evolving so fast that scientists can't find a way to fight them. On top of that, viruses are mutating constantly. They keep having to find new antibiotics and vaccines to defeat them. In fact, some strains of bacteria are becoming drug resistant. It's quite a scary time right now. I mean, we are witnessing this all firsthand. In our sixth spot, we have the zombie invasion. Over the years, the fear of a zombie outbreak has been on the rise. We can thank The Walking Dead and other shows for that. But in all seriousness, zombies can become a thing. According to scientists, there could be a cordyceps out there that could cause this to happen. Cordyceps is a type of parasitic fungi that attacks a host and then takes over the host. Usually we see this happen to insects, but scientists say it could happen to humans too. Dun, dun, dun. If it does happen, then it would turn us into brain dead zombies. But they did say the chances of this happening are one out of a million though. Still, the fact they say it might happen is terrifying, okay? There could be zombies, scientists said it. We're now at our fifth and halfway mark with the multiple Earths. In 2014, NASA discovered several interesting planets. One of them is named Kepler-452b. Don't know who named that, but they should be fired. It is a planet that closely resembles Earth. In fact, it's the most Earth-like planet outside of our solar system. In fact, NASA estimates that there are 1 billion Earth-like planets in the Milky Way alone, meaning there has to be life on those planets. Scary fact is, the life on those planets might be way more advanced than us. 
They just know that there has to be other intelligent life forms out there somewhere, which is cool, but also very daunting. Like they could take over Earth if they really wanted to. Moving on to number four, we have the caterpillar zombie virus. This is a pretty scary virus that targets caterpillars. I'm glad it can transfer over to humans and you'll understand why. Basically, caterpillars that have this virus will eat until they get so fat. They just keep eating until their body can't take it anymore and they literally explode. When they explode, they spray guts everywhere. And any caterpillars that get sprayed will then contract this virus as well. So they literally eat themselves to death until they burst. Imagine if humans got this, like you're walking down the street and next thing you know, someone explodes on you. That's disgusting. Moving on to number three, we have the junk food. In 1948, researchers discovered just how bad junk food really is for you. In a study with over 5,000 residents, they were looking at the risk factors for heart disease. That's when they found people that ate good tasting food, like fries, ice cream, brownies, chips, you get it. They were more prone for heart disease as well as diabetes and stroke. The researchers discovered just how disturbing the effects junk food and fast food have on the body, which is sad because I just wanna eat chips and burgers all day and not have to worry. Moving on to number two, we have the plastics, and I'm not talking about the girls from the Mean Girls. If you know, then you know. Okay, we all know that plastics are bad for the environment and that they're polluting the earth. But in 2014, another shocking discovery was made about plastics. They discovered that BPA found in most plastic products acts like synthetic estrogen. This means that constant exposure to it can lead to fertility problems or even cause tumors in women's uteruses. Long-term exposure can also lead to breast cancer, heart attacks, and diabetes. Basically, by drinking and eating food from these plastic containers, you're ingesting these chemicals into your body. So it could be slowly killing you and you don't even know it. And in our number one spot, we have the parasite. If you're eating something right now, I suggest you put your food away because you're about to lose your appetite. Trust me, this next discovery is very disgusting. So basically there was a Russian woman that discovered a small lump below her left eye. She didn't really think anything of it until the lump moved. It moved above her eye. And then next thing you know, there was a bump on her lip. That's when she reached out and got medical attention. Turns out she had a thread-like worm living in her body. This is known as dirofilaria repens. It typically infects dogs, cats, foxes, and other wild animals. But turns out they can transfer to humans too. How lovely. It can be spread by mosquito bites. Then this worm will live in your tissue under your skin. Ugh, no thank you. All right guys, that's all for today's video. Let me know in the comments below which one of these discoveries you found the grossest. That little worm thing, ugh, no, it disgusts me. And now we are moving on to our comment shout out portion, but I'm not reading out any comments. No, I specifically picked the weirdest of the weird comments and decided to shout them out today, you know, just have some fun. So Justin Cameron commented, anyone who dares call Lindsay a Karen will get a steel chair to the back of the head. Thank you, Justin, for defending me. Um, but maybe that's not how we resolve issues. That's something a Karen would do. Like, did you just call me a Karen? And then picks up a steel chair and just ba bam. So maybe just don't do that. But thank you. Jeffy Jeffy commented, Lindsay got that peach. <laughs> Damn right I do. <laughs> oh God, sorry, that was so gross. Ah, I hate myself. William McGarfey commented, the girl got game. Yeah, I got lots of games. I got Mario Kart, I got Legend of Zelda, which game you wanna play? Nancy Drew, let me know. See what I did there? Sean Grantham commented, I bet everyone on this list would have been happier with chocolate microscopes. See, I put this on here because I really just don't know what you mean. What are chocolate microscopes? Like scientific microscopes made out of chocolate? And what does that even mean? What do you mean, Sean? What is going on? All right, guys, that's all the weird and wacky comments I'm shouting out for today's video. If you want to be featured in my next comment shout out, then comment something weird down below. With that being said, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to Most Amazing Top 10 for more amazing videos. I've been your host, Lindsay Ivan, and I'll see you when I see ya. If you develop, yo, uh, shitstosomasis. She's to so mace, ha who? One second. I did look up how to say this, but I forget.
schistosomiasis. Oh, I think it's schistosomiasis. Pronunciation. Schistosomiasis. Schistosomiasis. According to scientists, there could be a cordyceps. I think it's cordyceps. 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 Cordyceps, whatever. This is known as the diphil, no, dirofilaria repens.